As a manufacturer, you want to be able to discover new RFQs and set filters to see them over time. The first thing you want to do is give your filter a name. In this case, it'll be castings. Then you want to select your process. We have a new multi-select process that you can go through and select either individual sub-processes or select top-level processes like castings as a whole to view those RFQs. You can do the same with the post-processes. Have the same selector here. And scroll through and pick which one suits your needs. And if you did not want to have that process in your filter, you would then select that and remove it from your filter. You do the same with material. Select that. By our location, pick which part of the world you want your RFQs to come from. You can narrow that down by state or province if you want to by using the same selector. You can select the proximity to me, so 50 miles, 100 miles, 250 to 500 miles near you. Geometry, whether it's prismatic or cylindrical, and how big those parts are that you want to quote. The units of measure in inches or millimeters. Any keywords that you might want to search by for the RFQ. Also the tightest tolerance of that RFQ, loose, medium, or tight. We've also got this checkbox here that's checked automatically to include these filters in the daily summary that gets sent to you. Now you can search these things uh, without saving it, or you click Save and Search, you land on your Save Filters page where your RFQs are there for you to interact with.